माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू एडियोरा आई एम नवनीता घोष योर मैथ्स एक्सपर्ट वी हैव लर्न हाउ टू फाइंड आउट द एरिया ऑफ डिफरेंट जोमेट्रिकल शेप्स राइट बट वी ऑफन सी मेनी लैंड्स ग्राउंड प्लॉट्स अराउंड आर्स विच आर नॉट ऑफ ऑल दिस शेप्स दे आर इरेगुलर शेप्स एंड दे डू नॉट रिजम्बल एनी शेप वॉट एवर वी हैव लर्न टिल डेट फॉर एग्जाम्पल टेक द मैप ऑफ एनी कंट्री can you say which shape it is it can't be a proper geometrical shape right it will be an irregular shape so what we will do in that case in that case what we do is we divide the area into small small parts which are of the known geometric figures and then we find out the areas of those figures and then add them together to find out the area of the plot so engineers what they have done they used to maintain a field book for this method and that is why this method of finding the area of irregular polygon is known as field book let us take an example look at the field of a village farmer ramlal it is looking like a pentagon which is not regular in shape that is the sides of the pentagon are not equal he needs to calculate the total cost of plowing at the rate of rupees 14 per meter square can you help him out finding the cost first we will name the field okay because in geometry or mensuration what we do we name a figure same way we will name the field of ramlal let the name be p q r s t then divide the land into smaller parts Ramlal measured sum of the lengths as PR is equal to 24 meter, PN is equal to 18 meter, PO is equal to 10 meter, QM is equal to 5 meter, SN is equal to 9 meter, TO is equal to 7 meter. So, area of PQRST is equal to area of triangle PQR plus area of triangle SNR plus area of trapezium TONS. plus area of triangle top and we know all these formula right area of a triangle area of a trapezium all we have learned earlier so let us put the values this will be equal to half into pr into qm plus half into nr into sn plus half into sn plus to into qm which is a trapezium and then plus half into po into to as you know that area of a triangle is half into base into height and area of a trapezium is equal to half into sum of the parallel sides into the distance between them so let's put the values is equal to half into 24 into 5 plus half into 6 into 9 Plus half into nine plus seven into eight plus half into ten into seven. On calculation, we get this is equal to sixty plus twenty-seven plus sixty-four plus thirty-five altogether is equal to one eighty-six meter square. So cost of plowing obviously will be equal to rupees one eighty-six into forty, which is equal to rupees. 2604 so this much money he has to spend to plow his garden